When it comes to the media settings for your WordPress website, I like to leave the thumbnail size, the width and height as 150. I untick everything else, and but I set my medium size and my large size down to zero. I wanna show you what happens if you were to leave this as default and you drop an image into your media library. So I'm gonna drop an image in here called Pax, and you have just one image. But let me now show you what you would see in your actual files and databases if you were to go and inspect it. There are now five versions of that image in my database the original i know it's 527 kilobytes and it's a png normally you would add in a webp image but i just wanted to show you how this works and then we got four other versions of it okay we've got the 150 150 which i would normally keep but then we got 768 500 and 300 as well and when you start to total that all you're just taking up space on your server and imagine you've added in 100 images and it's gone and created four or five extra versions how can we sort that out? Dead easy and simply with a code snippet. Go and use the free code snippets plugin. The link for this is in the video description. What this will do is when you drop your image in, it keeps the original, but it also allows the 150 by 150 for thumbnail sizing to exist as well. But everything else will not be saved or be existent or present within your files or database. Let's go and save changes and activate this and go and drop in another brand new image. And this one is a 293 by 349. It's just one image, it's landed. Let's go over to our database. And my database is only showing two images, the original and the 150 by 150. So if you've ever had this problem where you're dropping in images and you didn't even realize that there were duplicates being created, this is going to help you out. Now, I will mention both that the original PAX images, they're still present. Okay, they've not been eradicated because you're going to have to manually go through and sort them out. But from the get go with a brand new website, if you were to stick this in, and I must stress that I haven't modified the media settings here, it will now reduce the space on your server being taken up by these other sizes. You get the original image with your original resolution and all of that, but you also get the thumbnail size. I must stress again, I think I've just said it, I will stress, but I'm going to stress it again upon the previous stress. I have not changed the media settings here, okay? I have not zeroed them out. But that code snippet is going to stop the duplicates from being created. Hey, I'm Imran from Web Squadron. Catch you soon. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life, have no shame, there's no time, feel the pain, let the grind, I could change, in my mind, pick a lane, commit and climb, the only way to win it life, I never miss that fact, taking big swings.